Hey guys, this is kind of a serious video and I know some of you are already getting ready to turn off this video, but I wanted to address this issue that goes on a lot and I've been getting a lot of this comment. It's not really an issue, but another thing that I wanted to talk about and address later on after I talk about this, but I've been getting a lot of comments like, you can, can you show your face? I want to see your face. I want to know what you look like. No, I'm not comfortable showing my face on YouTube and some people just have to respect that. I mean, I personally don't want to show my face at all because I'm not comfortable with it. Um, a few of my Instagram friends have seen what I look like because we're friends and we should know what each other looks like so I'm not gonna tell you who they are because I know some people are gonna go attack them and hate on them and stuff like that and I don't want that the thing is some people just don't understand that there's creepy people out in the world and they I don't know if there's creepy people watching my videos or not I don't know the people behind the usernames I don't know you guys very well um, some of you I do because you comment on my videos, but a lot of you I don't know you and who you are behind your username and behind your comment. And I don't think I could handle if someone pointed out something that was wrong with my appearance. Wrong in quotes. Personally, I just couldn't handle that and... I just don't want to, so please stop asking. It's just some people just don't understand. And if you ask, I find that kind of creepy. And yeah, just don't ask. It's pretty creepy. Another thing I wanted to talk about is haters. Haters, there's many things to say about haters. But what they do is they comment something hateful on your video, on your picture, on Instagram, anywhere and what they do is try to get attention. If you give them the attention, you're feeding them what they want. So any person that leaves a mean comment on your video, like I'm looking one at one right now, and it says copier, this was AJ Overseas fan idea of making the doll themed room, or same with the music she added the same in here video, you nasty mouse brain. Now that's funny to me, because it makes no sense. I, I'll probably delete it before you guys can see it, but it's it was on the American Girl Kanani's Bedroom video, and I specifically said in the description the idea of this video was inspired by AG Overseas fan. I'm not copying her. She did make a Kanani Bedroom video, but that was after me, and I don't consider her copying me because I was inspired to do one and I had most of Kanani's collection so I thought I would do one for myself. Each of our videos are different from each other because she added her own elements to Kanani's room and I added my own elements so personally I did not copy her at all. It was just an inspiration of her videos. I, I actually really enjoyed making the room. To add on to haters, there's a lot of photo stealers on Instagram. And a lot of people, what they like to do is go to the hater account and comment mean things to them in the comments of their pictures, which usually they're someone else's pictures that they stole. And if they comment on that picture saying, this is so-and-so's picture, why did you steal it? Take it down now. Like, if you say that to them, say something mean to them, they're, you're just giving them the attention that they want. What I would do is just block, report them, and move on. That's basically all you have to do. Like, literally, some people take those people way too seriously. And you, they're just feeding the haters what they want. And that's what they want you to respond in a hateful way. They want attention, and if you give them attention, they're just going to keep doing it. And if you just ignore them, they're going to most likely go away and leave you alone. So, just, just ignore them. I mean, 
it's really not that hard. Most of the time, haters don't know how to spell, and they have bad grammar and all this stuff, and, you know, some people just need to learn to laugh at them, delete their comment, and move on with their life. And it's not that hard. For me, anyway. Other people take them way too seriously and, like, cry over it, and it's like, you know, it's a person behind a device. You don't know that person, whether they could actually say that to your face or not, because a lot of people that are hateful behind their computers or whatever, they would never be able to say that to your face. Like, I could comment something hateful to someone and in real life I would never be able to say it to their face, so why would I comment that? I would never hate on anyone anyways, but I could go on forever about them, but just know that you can ignore them and not give them attention because that's what they're looking for is attention. If you give it to them, they're just going to keep doing it. Uh, those are pretty much the things that I wanted to address in this video. I'm sorry about this video. I know it's kind of boring, but I, <laughs> you don't have to comment, rate, and subscribe. Maybe you want to comment to add on to some issues that I just talked about. Um, but I wanted to thank you guys. For those of you who did watch, thank you. I love you, and I hope you have a great day. Bye!